Uh, all right, Super, what's up, man? <laughs> Mrs. Anderson, thank you so much for you know, working through this with me and, and uh, in spite of our technology opportunities to excel. Um, so for all of you watching live or even the recorded video, we've got Mrs. Anderson here and she's going to be sharing with us a, a, a really neat question. I'm super excited about the question that we're going to get a chance to ask her. But ma'am, could you in the meantime tell us a little about yourself? How long have you been homeschooling? How long have you been classical conversations? And then how long have you been directing? Okay, uh, I've been homeschooling um, 11 years. I've been with classical for 11 years. And I've been, this is my third year directing. Okay, awesome. Wow, that's what you got. You're like super experienced. That's awesome. Yeah, and so, I still, I have to say, I still thought I was not qualified. So if anybody out there is thinking, I don't think I'm qualified. That feeling, I don't think it goes away. <laughs> I think it goes away after you do it a few years, but the first, to, when you're first thinking of doing it, oh man, that's a that's a big job, you know? But yes. with God's help, you can do it. That's right, amen, that's right, man, that's awesome. So man, the question of the day is, does or has, your three years of directing, has, has your, um, role of directing interfered with your homeschooling your own children? Okay. Um, I was afraid of that. I was very concerned about how am I going to, you know, everybody always feels like they're behind, we're behind, you know, you have one or two great days and you think, yeah, I crushed it. I'm doing this. I'm a homeschooler. And then, you know, two weeks later, you're back on the, oh, you know, so, um, that was definitely a concern, um, but I have to say that since taking on directing, it has actually enhanced our homeschooling because everything that I, I, I did know a lot, but now I know even more because I have to know more to pass that on to other people. So that responsibility has been a good thing for me and I've been able to pass it on to my kids. And uh, I'll say this too, <laughs> the one, the, science experiments that we do at CC and the art and things like that, I would never do that at home. You know, I'd say, oh, thank God for classical conversations. And now I do it at home too, because I've gotten my feet wet and I've taken it on and I can do it. So it's been a good thing. That's great, man. That's awesome. A great perspective. Man, is there a particular Bible verse that has really encouraged you throughout your years or a particular passage or you know what I mean, uh, that has really encouraged you during your homeschooling journey? Um, well, I will tell you the one that is good for me um, personally and, of course, with homeschooling is that God is my rock and he is my fortress. And I trust in him in everything that I do. And that is what gets me through um, if I feel like I'm having a hard day or, you know, oh, how am I going to handle this? I just always turn back to him. And also directing the challenges that I faced in directing have drawn me closer to the Lord, which is such a beautiful thing. So yeah, God is my rock. He is the thing that I stand on no matter what. Amen. That is awesome, man. For those of you all that are uh, watching this and would like to see more awesome interviews uh, like Mrs. Anderson here, please go to check out the CC's YouTube channel and search the playlist called Meet CC Directors. You can also check out classicalconversations.com forward slash CC director for more information about being, being a director. Um, man, thank you so much for sharing your great skinny and the patience with the technology. I totally appreciate it, ma'am. Great to thank meet you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Have a great day, ma'am. You too. Bye, Novo. Bye-bye.